guys this is gonna be a short stream I'm just testing the game testing my stream settings all that and for this I chose the game day of the diver I've been playing it lately and I've I quite like it I really really like it Okay, so I've set up OBS, set up all of that, I'm ready to start playing. And that's just what I'm gonna do, we're gonna start a new game, here we go. Yes, we can overwrite existing data, he's gonna, he's gonna ask us to confirm because it will wipe out our saves. And here we are, in the beach with oh hermit crab crawling around and us dave are just enjoying ourselves in the sun as the hermit crab is gonna do what oh dear lord oh no little hermit crab don't do that go away that's a huge hermit crab god damn so this is cobra calling And what does Cobra want? Cobra is talking about sushi. Okay. Seems to be good. So, let's go. Let's have some, some sushi. We were on a plane. Cool plane. The old pixel art is great. And this intro is really, really good. I uh, really love the, the indie feel. It's not about the graphics, it's not about the AAA, the AAA shine, it's, it's about the game and the gameplay and game designers in the indie, on indie studios, they always have to uh, come up with, uh, invent, with some inventive ways to overcome the the huge ad advantage that AAA games have over them. What they usually do is come up with really, really great gameplay stories, and some of them shine really hard. Some of them really shine. So I'm allowing us to to watch the credits. Uh, this is going to be just a testing stream. Uh, we're gonna just try things out, look at the game. I might be interrupted at any time. But just, let's just look at what, what we can get. I'm gonna review the stream later, so I got here quick. Yeah, sushi. Yeah, and I'm already suited up. I was told to hurry, and I was on vacation, you know. So, where's the sushi at, yeah? You told us about sushi. Don't rush yourself, have a look around. Okay. This is the giant blue hole. I've never seen anything like this. Pretty cool. Not just the size, everything you went... Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes. Which isn't exactly true, but okay. Which means, this could be an incredible business opportunity. Sure. And the business is... We can discuss that later. I heard you took a, a break from diving. How about warming up? Okay. I'll get you from here. I'll go ahead and go in. So, we'll go in. Yeah. You shouldn't have a good feeling about Cobra. He's very shady. A sushi bar by the blue hole. Certainly. So, this is just... Uh, tutorial thing, the very very basics we're gonna dive here we've got one of the fish we can find in the blue hole on the shallows and here we are stretching a bit moving to the marked area move quickly with left shift all that stuff so let's just go ahead and move 
as you can see we've got the depth we've got the weight we can carry and the O2 we've got left okay now I've moved to where I was supposed to and he's telling me my skills are as nimble as a snail is a is a dastardly one yes yeah, spectral i'm doing this i'm just trying i'm just trying to 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 do something different just trying to let off some steam and to testing the new i installed the new obs and i'm just testing everything see if the overlays got imported correctly uh and I was just trying out the this game, uh, this game I told you about, and now he's gonna put us to practice on the dive on the dive net. So let's see, survival knife on a small fish, if I can catch it. Okay, so let's go. Yeah, it's not easy to get a small fish with this, but we'll try. Okay, come on. Oh, it wasn't to catch a fish, it was just to try out the blade. Oh. Fine. No, I haven't forgotten how to use the harpoon. I know how to do it. Don't worry about it. Three fish. Great. Yeah, I know how to catch it. So we just aim, shoot, and reel it in. Just that. Aim, shoot, reel it in. Nothing fancy, nothing special. This is it. Yeah, I think that should get you back in track, on track in no time. Sure. All right, come back to the boat. Let us then go back to the boat. Okay, so now we've got a little unfolding of the story, and proper gameplay won't start till later on. And now let's see what business he was talking about. Okay, we love sushi, right? Yes, of course. And for sure the soft fish meat with oily rice. I'm not sure about the oily rice thing because you don't really use oily rice for sushi. You just do the, the rice, you add salt, uh, Miriam vinegar, if you have it. If not, uh, just made the just made the, a mix with the sugar, vinegar, and salt. Heat it up a little and, and just place it on the rice. The rice has to be cooked properly, and you have to left it to leave it to cool down. But I can't see what he's talking about oily rice. Okay. Listen up, I have a friend who is a sushi chef who's left the business for a while. Okay. Sharp tongue, slight temper, but he has one skill that I guarantee is unmatched in the world. Sure. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one of a kind sushi. That's nice. Sushi sold here is made from fresh fish caught in the blue hole. Yeah, just just next door. You can see the restaurant in the distance, like a little pier. So, fresh fish caught in the blue hole, where fish from all over the world can be found. Also nice. Don't you think people will go nuts for it? It depends how many tourists are coming. Yep, I'm craving it. Yeah. I bet so. Why don't you join in? on this awesome adventure as well what do you say i'm horrible at reading shit why don't you join in on this awesome adventure as well what do you say i mean i love eating but i don't know a thing about cooking okay nothing to worry about the restaurant is already nice for corba to call us when things are already done but this is shady all you need to do is dive to get the ingredients you know, right. You, we knew there was a catch. Doesn't sound too bad, right? I mean, sure, I love to dive. 
so I can eat as much sushi as I want. Yeah, sure. You have to pay though. <laughs> Can't wait to check it out. The sushi restaurant next to the blue hole. Yeah, that's cool. I was it was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. So now we're gonna pick the boat up and we're gonna go to the sushi bar. You can see it there. So here we arrive at the sushi bar. That says we are ready to open as you can see it's just ready in time this is the the sushi man he's a great artist Pancho oh it's already finished yeah everything is ready you you are the fisherman Cobra was talking about that's Dave for you let's see well I'm more of a diver than a fisherman yes all right. Anyway, it's nice to meet you. Uh, to meet you, I'm Bencho. That's him. So you like sushi? Yep, I sure do. Tuna belly, eel, sea urchin. Never had sea urchin or eel, for that matter. I've had tuna, but uh, I don't know if it's the tuna belly. Oh boy, just thinking about it makes my mouth water. Yeah, sushi is pretty good. Mm, just as mediocre as expected. Well, fuck you too, mate. Sushi is a food that combines the soul of the sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. That's uh, a bit of an exaggeration, but okay. Most people have only tasted more accessible fish just like you. Sure, let's go with it. How empty a life is. One that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer. Well, I'll... Uh, been doing so far been doing good so far my calling is to bring the taste of mother nature to every what oh dear oh dear an earthquake tsunami well that's that's what being a braggadocious gets you it's all ruined yeah an earthquake yeah the interior is quite a mess, it's all fucked up. Yeah, it looks like we won't be... It looks like we will have to delay the opening today. Really? No shit? No, let's just open it. I mean, it's a cool look. Smoking... The smoking uh, speakers. Uh, it's great. Just great. Top notch. You know what? I spent all my money getting this restaurant ready. I'll have to recover the repair costs through doing business. <laughs> there he goes into the shady stuff. In this state? Wahaha! <laughs> In the end, the importance of the restaurant is the taste. Yes, but the seating arrangements would also be uh, equally important, I suppose. People could sit on the ground, but I don't think that would work. First, we need ingredients. Did you bring anything? Ah, I brought a, f a couple of fish. But they are small fish. Hmm. Only three fish? Yeah, the guy only told me to bring three fish. I had no freaking idea they wanted more. We nearly enough to serve the guests. What fucking guess? I was just supposed to come here. Was I supposed to guess that there was gonna be a fucking earthquake? Please go and catch seven more fish first. Well, shit. Now they're the, I haven't seen anything, and uh, I'm already put at work. Put to work. God damn. The rest is going to be open only in the evening. Yeah, I suppose. Won't that decrease sales? You stupid. Yeah, right. When? When do you want them to to tidy up everything? Yeah, let's open it. We don't have any food and everything is broken. But let's open it. Bullshit. We, I, you think we should invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little money? Calling him out on this shit. See? See? That's what happens. It is a chief's duty to prepare the simplest possible food. As you can see, when I read... I tend to not read what's there, and my mind reads something else. See, it's, it's something my brain does. 
spectacular. The chef's duty to prepare the best possible food with meticulous precision, just as a warrior sharpens his sword on a wheatstone. Okay, there we go. You will need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. I'll get you what I get. But, uh, so, okay. Where are we going? Yeah, I'm just gonna do half an hour. Uh, I ain't gonna do more. I also want to export this to YouTube. Probably start uh, some sort of series. Uh, some sort of, um, of long play. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. Okay. Not seen Benjo so enthusiastic since the incident. It was just a second ago, idiot. It, it's not hard to to hear him speak enthusiastically about getting his restaurant back since it happened like an hour ago. It's nice to see him like this. Well, he was pretty devastated when the when the when the shit hit the fan. So I'm not sure what what variations of humor you were expecting within an hour, but okay. The incident. Oh, they're talking about something else. What happened? Okay, there was something happened. We don't know what what it was yet, but it was worth. It was worse than an earthquake. Let's just go with that. Okay, so let's catch seven fish, which is just. And we are owing one hundred bucks. Why are we? Why are we owing money to? Must be to cobra. I don't know. Okay, let's get the fish. Let's get the fish. A puffer, starry puffer. Those are nice. Okay, so. Let's catch a cardinal here. They are pretty small, but let's get an example of each. A cardinal, yellowback fusilier. I think these are combers, I'm not sure. Yeah. Uh, let's get a tank. I think these are tanks, not sure. Let's get ourselves a orbicular. Come here, orbicular dear. Yes, and let's get ourselves a blue tank. Come here, little blue tank. Yes. How many fish do I need still? Uh, I can't get that. Should I get one of these? Sure, why not? I just have to stand here and stab it. Stab it, 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 stab it. Stab it. Oh, one of those. Yeah, I'm gonna get one of those as well. Yep, there we go. Okay, I've had. I now have seven fish. I can go back, but I'm not going back yet. Here we go, another one. Oh, I need to pull it. Okay, a lagoon tiger fish. That's okay. Yeah, we can get another if we want. As we can see, we now have a cargo pack that can carry uh, nine kilos. Okay, we're gonna get a bit of copper. Just because hey, I'm here, why not? I still, I still got a little oxy oxygen left, and hey, I'm showing you the game, so let me show you the game properly. These are all components. Uh, we catch lumber, we catch scrap iron, we, we catch lots of things. The more yields are something we can only tackle later on, and sometimes we find these oxygen tanks that we can use to get our oxygen back so no big deal just standard stuff sometimes you find uh, these one use oxygen tanks sometimes you find portable oxygen tanks okay let's check it out and we've got a cheap japanese sword so these i can use to hit the fish there you go no the fish run away from me they are way too fast. I mean, I could catch them, but what, what's the goddamn point? Okay. We catch more wood. Because you're going to need... These are all ingredients. Ingredients. They are parts that you can use later on to manufacture weapons or have someone manufacture weapons for us. 
Oh, one of these parrot fishes. That's gonna be great. And a lionfish. Lionfish is good. Come here, little lionfish. Yeah, our our stuff isn't top notch yet. Our harpoon is quite is quite weak. Have we caught one of those? I don't remember. Okay, as you can see, we are now reaching the depth limit of our uh, suit, and it isn't advisable to go for, uh, to go further anymore because if you do your oxygen uh, expenditure will uh, increase really really fast and oxygen oxygen is everything in this game oxygen is uh, the oxygen is uh, your life because uh, when your oxygen depletes you're dead but your oxygen is used for everything you know like your life is your oxygen what I mean is, when you get hit, when you get hurt, that spends oxygen. You, you don't have a separate uh, life indicator. It just spends your oxygen. I'm trying to get a bit, a bit more buck for my money and carry one of these parrotfish. And so, we are out of the water. We're just going to do one night at the, at the cafe, Sashiba, and then... I'm gonna stop the stream, I'm gonna analyze it, I'm gonna see how it went, if all the voices are okay, if everything is good. Okay, so we are going to return to the boat, and upon returning to the boat, we are going to get the get back to the pier, uh, to the sushi bar. As you can see, it takes a bit of time to load, not too much. But still makes me talk about nothing at all for a second, and it looks like it kind of is kind of stuck. You see, these are all things that happen. See, so okay, did it finally load? I mean, this this isn't a bad computer, but it's being stupid right now. Okay, here we go. Yeah, it just went to... everything just went to shit, so I'm gonna stop the recording and we'll come back later. I'm gonna analyze it and I'm gonna see if this is something I wanna keep doing. But thank you guys for being there and I'll catch you later.